Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be taking you along with us, um, me and my kids, <laughs> during our day. I have already showered this morning. My hair's up in that like towel scrunchie. I'm not gonna wear makeup today. I did some really good skincare, so I'm gonna just let my skin be and not be filled with makeup. Um, I am dressed, I still have slippers on. Um, but I am dressed for the day, so it's good. I'm currently participating in uh, a Facebook challenge group from this mama's house. Uh, her name's Tabitha. She's over here on YouTube as well. Um, she's doing the 31 baby steps for Fly Lady, and I decided, you know what, I'm just going to participate in it. I've done, I've tried like a little bit of Fly Lady, but... I've never really been consistent or anything, so I'm going to give it a go until I have this baby. Um, I don't have a whole lot going on today, so you will see probably a little bit of cleaning in this video. Uh, we have to do some schoolwork with the boys. My six-year-old is already finished with his math book. He got it done from September to December instead of September to June because he's a little math ways. So I just ordered him a new book. I think it was too easy for him. So he is in first grade, but he's, he, he's really good at math. <laughs> so I ordered him an advanced first grade math book instead of just like, uh, I, he was doing like a kindergarten first grade math book. So it's like, a l I think it was just a little too easy. So now this book is advanced, so it's more like first and second grade. So I think he'll do good and maybe it will last the rest of the year. If not, oh well. I'm happy to buy more math books. Um, so he doesn't have any math or anything. So for him, he's just gonna work on some writing and um, like letter blends and stuff and then my third grader has quite a bit to do, and then Carter is going to do some scissor cutting today, and um, some handwriting, practicing his name, and little Benny, he's just going to be at the table scribbling all over everything, because that's what he does, he's two. <laughs> but yeah, so we're going to get some homeschooling done, and then I do have an appointment later today. I have a massage appointment at three and then a chiropractor appointment at four. So, and they're in this, they're in the same building. Um, so that's going to be nice, but I do have a couple of kids who have colds. So if they are super under the weather, I will have to cancel. Um, but if they're feeling okay, my mom's okay with watching them as long as they're not like fevered and you know, all like laying around, not feeling good, whiny, you know, <laughs> as long as it's just like the sniffles, she's totally cool with watching them. So I can go to this appointment because who doesn't want a massage and go to a chiropractor, especially when you're almost 34 weeks pregnant. <laughs> so yeah, uh, I'm not 100% sure what we're doing today, but I'm going to take you guys along with us and we'll see what happens? My house is messy. My little guy before bed had fun and I was just too tired to clean up the floor and the older kids had already picked up once and so I wasn't gonna have them do it again. Um, although they would have. Uh, I don't have like a ton of dishes. I do, I will unload the dishwasher and put the couple that are in the sink in there. And that's pretty much, yeah, what I'm going to do right now. I'm just going to sit and relax with my coffee and yeah, I'll catch up with you guys in just a little bit. Okay, so I am just brushing my hair now. It's still pretty wet but it feels so much better now that the oils have set um so today in that group you know how I was talking about fly lady earlier it the 
like task for the day, it's the 31 baby steps, is to download the Fly Lady app. And I downloaded it and I actually really like it. And I am gonna start, today's the last day of like one of like the, I think it said it was the last day of like the zone cleanings. And um, it also has like the morning routine and things like that. And I went in and I edited it to fit like my lifestyle and my family's lifestyle and stuff. And I'm super excited. I obviously didn't do the weekly home blessing, but I wanna do it on Fridays anyways, because then my house is set for the weekend when my husband's home and all of that. Um, yeah, so I like the idea of doing the weekly home blessing on a Friday anyway, so I'm gonna kind of do that and I'm gonna work on um, more of the morning routine. Um, I just have to unload the dishwasher, which I think I said that earlier that I was going to do it anyways. Start a load of laundry, eat breakfast, which I still need to do that. I just barely finished my coffee. I took it slow this morning. Um, and obviously, you know, get ready from, you know, get dressed and stuff. I'm going to just keep my slippers on though until it's closer to time for me to leave. And I need to make my bed. But I think I'm going to actually strip my bed today. Um, because I have some new sheets I want to put on. And I have a new like bed set. That, so like we obviously sleep with different blankets. I've talked about that in other videos. Um, because my husband and I are both blanket hogs. But I want our bed to still look nice. And so I am going to... Um, put the like quilt on the bed as well so that way it's just we just sleep on top of it and then we'll just fold our blankets at the end of the bed and hopefully that will make it look nicer okay and something that always makes me feel put together is just putting on my earrings. Look at how my leggings and stuff, they like, actually that's my underwear I think. Yeah, I wear like high maternity underwear, but like digs into me. I just ordered um, on Kohl's if you're, well, I don't know if they're still having it, but look at Kohl's if you're pregnant and you need some maternity leggings. Um, I got my favorite pair, which is a gray pair, for like $10, but they were on sale, and my sister-in-law had a coupon. So I got three pairs of maternity leggings for like, what'd you say, like 18 bucks or something? So I scored big, super happy about that. Um, Ta-da! That's as good as it's gonna get today, just because of, I want my skin to breathe. <laughs> it, needs, it needs a break. Um, cause I do have like acne prone skin and these little baby hairs, I'm going to have to hairspray them. Um, yeah, so hold on honey. Okay. It's a little better. So yeah, I have new maternity leggings coming. Um, and now I think I'm gonna work on uh, unloading the dishwasher and stuff and then hopefully I'll get to my bed, but if I don't, oh well.
Okay, here is the final product. I only use one pillow. Um, I know that's so weird, but I use blankets to support my belly and stuff. But if I have my pillow any higher than that, it hurts my neck. My husband, although he uses two. So it looks a little weird. And then we have this lumpy section because this is my husband's blanket. I use this one and this one. So I just have it kind of covered up. So it looks more like an actual made bed. So here we are. Another check mark done. So day, like, it's technically day three of the fly lady like 31 baby steps that I've been doing and I started the routines today and so far they're going really well um, obviously it's not perfect but my morning routine I did everything my afternoon routine I just didn't do the 15 minute decluttering and this I haven't really started my evening routine but I'm gonna start that pretty soon and that is pretty much just washing my face, brushing my teeth, um, checking my calendar for tomorrow, all of those kinds of things. So far, it's going good. I didn't really get much of my weekly home blessing done or any zone cleaning because of my sick, cranky kiddos. But that's okay. I'm taking it slow. This 31 days is just to get me like adjusted into the routines and the baby steps and all of the, those things. But on Sunday when the zone cleaning starts and the weekly home blessing is Monday, I am going to take it serious and I'm going to get all of the things done. So I'm going to wrap up this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, it ended up not really being a day in the life vlog as I originally thought, but more of a, I started fly lady vlog and that's okay. You know, sometimes when you pick up the camera, you have an idea of what you're going to do and then it just kind of changes and I want to share the fly lady journey with you guys. I decided that I'm going to do it. I'm going to share it with you and hopefully you guys enjoy it and maybe you guys want to get on board with it. Um, definitely check out the fly lady app. I think that it's way less overwhelming than the website. Definitely start with like the baby steps and the routines and stuff. But I will update you guys. Um, hold on, buddy. I will update you guys um, in a couple days after a couple days of doing it. So maybe like one video a week I will post, especially with Vlogmas going on. Maybe one video a week I'll give you guys like a Fly Lady update. If that's something you're interested in, let me know. Um, yeah, so I'm so excited about this.